Professor John saw it. My name is Akane. This is a story of when I was still in my early 20s and my skin was still in perfect condition. At the time, I was going out with a guy called Hidegi that I met in college, but one day, after about a year of working... Akane, I want to take care of you. Let's get married. Hidegi-kun, I'm so happy! I'm gonna be a wife! That's right. You're going to be the prettiest wife around. I was at the peak of my happiness, but there was one thing that was bothering me. Hey, we're going to get married, so you aren't cheating or planning on cheating, right? Huh? Uh, of course not! Why would I ever cheat on you? You're sure? Never, ever? Of course! From the bottom of my heart! Okay, then. But if you cheat, I'm gonna divorce you, no questions asked. Yeah, of course. I was worried about his woman situation. He's good-looking and is great at communicating. He's also very considerate. He's popular, and I've seen him almost having an affair, so I was even more afraid than I should be. Hidegi-kun! Akane! But he really faced his act and has been kinder than ever before. I guess that was what we had to go through to really strengthen our bond. I decided to trust him. However, two years later... Hey, Hidegi-kun! Hmm? What? Can you stop rolling around and help? You're off today, right? What? I'm normally working, so I'm tired. I work too, and we said that we would split the chores. What are you talking about? I make more money and work more. I mean, yeah, but... But you can at least clean the bath or take out the trash. Yeah, yeah, as soon as I get home. You're going out again? Yeah, I'm going to the bookstore. Then at least text me when you're getting home. Yeah, yeah. After getting married, I don't know where all his kindness went. He treated me like trash. He wouldn't help around the house, and he always just left on the weekends. We haven't been on a date for over a year. <sighs> I'm always the only one. But the biggest stress I had... Akane-san! Ah! Hello? You're a little slow to answer, don't you think? You didn't bring in a man, did you? Of course not! This old hag, my mother-in-law. This old, my mother-in-law keeps coming over without telling me about it, even after I asked her to stop. Are you cleaning up? Of course I am. What did you want today? You're bad at cooking, so I want to help you learn to cook. I'm sure you don't even know the ABCs of cooking. Of course I do. She comes over and starts going off about chores and how I need to be pregnant already. Maybe she's broken and all she can do is complain? That's honestly how annoyed I was. Have you vacuumed? There's hair around the sofa. Sorry, I'll fix it right away. Yeah, that's where your lovely son was rolling around lounging until two <laughs> seconds ago. I told Hidegi-kun about her nagging, but of course he didn't do anything about it. Mom cares about us, you know. You should be more understanding. Ugh, imagine you're the one that has to deal with it. Akane-san, you haven't cleaned the bath yet, have you? Oh, Hidegi-kun is going to do it after he gets home. Wow, you're going to make Hidegi do that? You just push it onto him, don't you? Do you understand that you're a married woman? Y yeah, of course. Lies! Your replies are so horrible, too. Talk about a bad daughter-in-law. Sorry about that. He doesn't show me any love or affection, and he's useless. And I have an overly aggressive mother-in-law. Honestly, I was at the end of my patience. Then, one day... It's been so long since going out for tea with you, Karin. My mother-in-law has just been coming to my house every day since getting married. I'm sure that old lady's probably in a world of trouble now that I'm not there. <laughs> Akane. Huh? There's something important I need to talk to you about today. Oh? What is it? Well, I wasn't sure if I should tell you, but look at this. What? what the hell is this? The photo that Karin showed me was shocking. My husband, Hideki, and a beautiful woman was walking to a hotel. What? Wait just a second! This woman! She's the wife the most famous wealthy man in Etra City! Why the hell is she with- Hideki was having an affair with a rich man's wife while I didn't know about it. I'm so sorry. I was just going home when I saw him, so... I was wondering if I should just take this to the grave with me, but after hearing you complain in your stories, I couldn't just keep it to myself. Karin, thank you for telling me. This is enough for me now. I'm getting a divorce! <sighs> Here we go. That wasn't a hard decision to make. I was furious I was gonna go find Hideki and beat some sense into him, but Karin told me that we need to pretend we don't know till we can get real evidence so that we can use it against him. I made sure to act normal so as to not arouse any suspicion, but... 
Hey, I poured us some tea. Uh, did you just break my teacup? He was very stupid, so I didn't need to think about it too much. I followed him around to make sure I could gather evidence of everything that was happening. I have to go home. I'm gonna miss you. Me too, Yuzuriha. He's the worst. Akane, I'll take the photo so you... <laughs> I got some great pictures there. Just go the whole nine yards in public this time so I can record it all. <laughs> uh, Akane, calm down. I think I was a little insane there too. Karin introduced me to a lawyer and we had enough meetings and evidence before it was now my turn. Later... What is this? You can read, can't you? We're getting a divorce. <laughs> Don't be joking. Why would you... I love you, Yuzuriha. You're the only one I love. Ah, oh, Hideki-san. <sighs> I told you in the beginning that we were gonna get divorced the second you cheat. You recorded this? Yeah. You thought that I was just an idiot that would never suspect a thing, right? <laughs> Unfortunate for you, I have friends that will lend me their help, so I don't have to be too smart. I've already talked to a lawyer, so I'm gonna be suing you and that bitch, too. What? Please, no! It was just a one-time thing! Please believe me! You're the only one I love! Don't touch me with your dirty hands! Ah! Hiragi! Mom? Perfect timing. I took Karin's advice and left the door unlocked for when she would be coming back home. What a great idea. How about you show your mother-in-law what a horrible son she has, huh? Look at the state your son is in now. You should have just in time. Mom, this is... Akane-san! How can you be so horrible? Huh? Oh, she only saw where I hit him. How dare you be violent towards Hidegi! You don't do anything around the house and all you do is fool around with the men! You cheap whore! What did you say? Cheap whore? Play with the men? Don't be coy with me! I've heard everything from Hidegi! You just go over to the other guy's places and don't do any chores! Mom, uh... Excuse me, Hidegi. What the hell is this about? Oh, um... Uh... I wasn't exactly the brightest ball, but I knew exactly what was happening. This horrible cheating man kept complaining about me and talking bad about me behind my back to his mother. That's why she was always mean to me. I'm so over this stupid woman. Get the hell out and don't ever show up around here again! <laughs> what, what the hell, you old bitch? <laughs> what? Huh? Wake the hell up! You're being played a fool by your own stupid son. Look at your own lovely son cheating too. Look! No, wait! Huh? What? You understand now. This is your son. I took this video a week ago. I did. Akane, please stop. But, but you were cheating first. I didn't cheat, you dumbass. I do everything around the house. He's the one that didn't do any chores here. You got some kind of proof of my affair or lack of activity around the house? Huh? You better find it quick or shut your ass up. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Hiragi, this is all fake, right? You said on the phone. I'm so sorry! Mom? I just took everything you said at face value. I thought you were going out and fooling around with guys while doing nothing around the house, so he said to educate you. What? I see. That's what you told your mom? No, I... I... I didn't... Uh, it, it must be some kind of misunderstanding on her part, right? You stupid son! <laughs> you complain so much about Akane-san to me. What the hell is going on here? Serves you right. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to my lawyer about that new detail, too. No, wait, please, I won't ever... Shut up, you stupid son! <laughs> Get him! My mother-in-law completely flipped sides and forced him to just cooperate and listen to every demand that I had in the divorce. Of course, I took all the money I could from Hidegi and his little mistress. Rumors of the affair spread all throughout the town quickly, and the mistress was getting divorced with her husband as well. My mother-in-law kept apologizing to me, but I don't forgive her for the horrible treatment she put me through, since she didn't even bother listening to what I had to say. But I'm glad that she knows the truth now. Later... <sighs> the divorce was such a pain. It's over now, though. I'm so glad I had you and your amazing lawyer, though. I think I would've just imploded. Yeah, you probably would've ran to the hotel room at that rate. But I'm free now and I have a lot of money. Wanna go to Hawaii sometime soon? Yeah, that sounds great. Let's go. About a half a year after divorce, Karin and I took a trip to Hawaii to heal my wounds. Woo! The beach is so pretty. Let's take pictures. Okay. 
Being married was tough, and now I have a history of being married, but I learned a lot, so I was able to be positive. I'm never going to fall for the wrong man. Oh my gosh, he's so hot! Akane, why do you always find the sketchiest guys? By the way, I was able to find a loyal and honest person that Karin introduced me to! Yay! ご視聴いただきありがとうございました。身内、しかも可愛がっている息子が不満を漏らしていたら、そちらの方を信じてしまいがちでしょうね。ですが、当事者同士ではないからこそ、中立な立場でお互いの話を聞いて判断することが一番